Hello, my favorite niece. Uncle Chuck, I have something for you. What is it, Dolores? A letter George the Postman just delivered. Oh, I've been expecting this. I'll deal with it later. Hello, my favorite niece. I just wanted to say how much I love you, Uncle Chuck. I love you too, Dolores. I can't wait for you to take over the pillow factory and restore the family heritage. I'd better not touch it. Uncle Chuck gets real angry if I'm too nosy. Just have to keep going. Carefully handling broken glass? If this were a Sierra Online graphic adventure, I'd be dead now. But those Mucus Phlegm adventure games treat their players much better. No arbitrary deaths just to extend gameplay? Sure would like to work there. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside except an empty glass. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. I don't think they're good for anything except growing mold. The glass is now filled with water. The fireplace looks very clean. my job application, but the I'm not going to drink from something without reading the label. Flask of Extreme Chili Sauce by Brian H.J. Comes with a warning. You might breathe fire. May better be care better be careful. Flask of Flask of Extreme Come. Maybe I should be Nice warm fire. <laughs> that will definitely make Uncle Chuck happy. Burning up his mail? No thanks. It's not my job to clean out the fireplace. The fireplace is very sooty and filled with ash. Great. Now I'm carrying around a handful of black soot.
It's an empty bottle of homemade printer ribbon ink. I see some black powder around the edges, and it smells awful. The ink bottle is now full of black fireplace soot. It's a bottle for printer ribbon ink with black soot in it. It's the math trophy I won when I was 12 and attending a summer program at Thomas Bodeman's School of Mathematics. It's Graphics Basic, the powerful program. The application is all filled out. It's special gas for chainsaws only. It's pretty full. Hmm, I printed my job application, but the page is blank. Maybe the printer is out of ink. There's just soot in the ink bottle, not ink. This isn't a water-based ink, not with that smell. And I wouldn't want to print something that could wash away. It's a bottle for printer ribbon ink with black soot in it. I don't think they're good for anything except growing mold. I don't feel like the taste for non-trademark infringing poopsie now. I think I'll just be careful with them. That's good enough. Still impressive. The ink bottle is now full of black ink. That should do it. The ribbon is now fully inked. Hmm, I printed my job at there. The blank paper is back in the Printron 3000. Yay! I answered all the me- I always like to watch this part. Now I just need to stamp the envelope. It's a letter to my Uncle Chuck. As expected, the post office's poorly programmed auto stamp cancellation machine has failed again. Amateurs. I'll have plenty of time to sleep once I get a job as a game designer. Max was the world's first computer-generated TV host. I don't want to pick that up. My letter to Mucus Phlegm is now stamped and ready to mail. Again. How exciting. I hope I get the job. Hi, Dolores. I have a letter for you. Oh. Good luck. See ya. Diggin'? Diggin'. I think I want to open this in my room. 
just in case it's really bad news. Now that I'm in my room, I'm still s Okay, but if it's a no, that means I'm stuck in Thimbleweed. Okay, but if it's a yes, what will become of Dad? Okay, but... Okay, okay, I'm opening it. Yes! It's a job offer from Mucus Phlegm to be a game programmer. I'm so excited! Can't wait to tell Uncle Chuck. He'll be so proud. But first... I can't wait to tell Uncle Chuck about my job offer. He'll be so proud. Hello, my favorite niece. Uncle Chuck! Uncle Chuck! Great news! Yes, Dolores, what is it, my dear future leader of Pillotronics? I, uh... Here, read this. You're what? You're giving up the opportunity to run Pillotronics to be, uh... To be a game programmer? Yes, that's what I've always wanted to do. Not run Pillowtronics. I'm leaving on the first bus out of Thimbleweed Park. Then, Dolores, you are out of my will. You're giving up over $10 million. That's $20 million in 2017 dollars. Just to pick an arbitrary date in the future, you are dead to me. Dolores broke Uncle Chuck's heart and started programming those murder simulators. Real life murder is the next logical step for her, sweetie. Stop her before she schemes her way into sweet Uncle Chuck's inheritance. Sure, we'll get right on that. Come back and see me soon, sweetie. Ciao. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get on with my plan. It's made of plastic. No murder here. Looks like this valve has been welded into position forever. It's sealed shut. No way to open it. I can't open that. The only thing I get from poking around these boxes is a case of sneezes. Looks like someone knew I was going to get stuck down here. Unless my kidnapper wrote that as a trap. Only one way to find out, I guess. I'm looking for an escape route, but I'm looking to go up. It needs a dime to work.
Hello, Reno. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It is uh, uh, quite annoying. No, sir. Yes, sir. They have been taken care of. Yes, sir. Permanently. Oh, yes, sir. Violently. No, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, wrestling was quite good tonight. Goodbye, sir. I can't open that. All the lights are out. It must be broken. The instructions say insert... Welcome to Quickie Pal. Can I help you find anything? It looks hungry. I don't have an extra finger, though. Take it. It was a sample from a traveling animal repellent salesman. But I doubt if it actually works. I wouldn't want to find out. Hi there, I'm Quickie Pal Leonard. How can I help you? I'm Junior Special Agent Reyes. Uh, I'm not Holden, if that's what you're thinking. <laughs> Do you know anything about the body by the river? No, but I heard the sheriff nearly ralphed when he saw it. The only bods I've seen lately are the righteous babes at the top shelf of the magazine rack. Let's not go there. Have you seen anyone acting suspiciously around town? Actually, now you mention it, I did see something suspicious a couple of nights ago. I was on the late shift getting ready to close up and grab some za, when Willie the town bum walks in. Was totally whack when I think about it. Why did Willie seem suspicious to you? Well, normally we have to toss him out because the dude smells grody and he never has any money. But for the first time in forever, Bro pulls out this wallet and flashes a fat stack of dead presidents. I thought it was kind of bitching when he bought out the liquor cabinet. Could the wallet you saw have belonged to Willie? <laughs> oh, no way. That wallet was his. I figured he got lucky and found it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But come to think of it, I'm pretty sure the wallet had some weird red stains on it. At the time, I thought it was the cherry mouthwash he drinks, but it could have been blood. Ugh, these flickering lights are going to drive me insane. <laughs> yeah, it's a trip, isn't it? Oh, they're even better if you get a little toked up and... Uh, <laughs> I mean, yes, officer, I'll get those fixed right away. Tell me a bit about yourself, Leonard. Dude, how do you know my name? Are you, like, telepathic or something? No. You just told me your name, and it's also on your name tag. Do you like your job here at the Quickie Pal? Heck yeah! I got a freaking sweet deal here, with free coffee and minimum wage. Plus, I don't get many customers on the late shift, so I get plenty of time to think. I'm going to look around your store. It's out of order. There's no path beyond this point. It just looks like unfinished temp part from a cut room. It's my specks of dust.
Not sure why, but okay. Seems like a waste of a good dime. Help. I'm trapped in the sewer. Please call the authorities and let them know. You'll notify someone. Thanks. I'm looking for- I got an emergency call about someone being locked in the sewer. <laughs> I should have expected, Reno, it was you. I don't like being interrupted when wrestling is on. Bad news, Sheriff. There are no Donut Arenos down here. This case doesn't seem like something the feds would be interested in, hmm? Now you should head back to the home office Areno before you get hurt. There is a killer on the loose. Yeah, I'll run that up the home office Areno flagpole. In the meantime, can you get me out of here? Sure, just follow me. No, oh, I will need to blindfold you. Nothing about this town surprises me anymore. Oh, there's a bus leaving in a few hours. I think we can handle the investigation from here, Areno. Definitely Agent Ray's notebook. I will, of course, refrain from perusing its contents. Agent Protocol. Here's your WC-67 tube. Thank you. All fixed. Here's our card in case you need any more plumbing help. We'll just clean up here and be gone soon. Pigeon Brothers Plumbing, Electrical and Paranormal Investigations. Thanks. I hope you kept your eyeballs off it. What am I going to do with a pile of dust? The bar's out of business. Hmm, too bad. I don't want to pick that up. Do you know this map is a priceless first edition? Please don't touch. Welcome to the Thimbleweed Nickel. Eight years of experience and two degrees in journalism tells me you're a fed. Why can't I take your map? I'm a federal agent. Okay, that's actually two questions. First, being a federal agent doesn't mean you can waltz into a newspaper office and take their map. Uh, we have a little thing called the Fourth Amendment. And second, that's a priceless original. If you want a map, check the Quickie Pal. Can I, as a private citizen, please have your map? Nope, it's a priceless original. We're here investigating the murder. Know anything? Not much, just what I heard over the police scanner. Body found in the river. I'll send my best reporter to check it out in the morning. 
Know who my best reporter is? <sighs> you? If this damn town wasn't such a podunk, I'd have a couple of Pulitzers by now. We'll need a complete press blackout. Not with the First Amendment still in place. The core of a strong democracy is a strong press. Don't you mean the Fifth Amendment? Nope. That sets out rules for indictment by grand jury in eminent domain and protects the right to due process. Don't you mean the Twelfth Amendment? No. That revises presidential election procedures. Don't you mean the 18th Amendment? No. That prohibited the manufacturing or sale of alcohol within the United States, but repealed in 1933. Don't you mean the Eighth Amendment? Nope. That prohibits excessive fines and excessive bail, as well as cruel and unusual punishment. Do you offer home delivery? Why? You plan on moving here? The town's got a charm to it. Nice chatting. Got a murder to solve. Please don't mess with the police scanner. I'm waiting for a call about a woman out by the circus littering. Attention all units. Enough screwing around. I've got a case to solve. Please don't mess with the pl I'm waiting for a woman out by the circus littering. Attention all unit. It's not much, but we're short a story on page four. I'll be back soon. Don't you touch my map. The Copytron takes nickels. Whoa there, little agent of Reno. You can't just go bumbling around the county without a map. It's too easy to get lost. There is a killer Reno on the loose. Yeah, you're right. I'll head back to town and find a map. You have to admit, it's a nice view of Reno up here.
Welcome to Quickie Pal. How can I help you? Uh, I'm not Holden, if that's what you're thinking. <laughs> Do you have any maps of the county? Oh, sorry, dude. We're all out of them. Sheriff Arino came by and nabbed them all. <laughs> Didn't even pay for them. Uncool. Way uncool, man. I'm going to look around your store. I found this bottle. I'd like five cents back for cleaning up the environment. Well, I'd like five cents from you for taking your bottle. <laughs> Just kidding. Quickie pal humor. Here you go. Please don't mess with the police scanner. I'm waiting for a call about a man out by the circus being noisy. I need to stay focused and solve this murder so I can get... Attention all units. It's not much, but we're short a story on page four. I'll be back soon. Don't you touch my map. What a nice copy. And in color, too. It's a map of the county. This should help me find my way around. You got any uh, secondhand crystals? <laughs> 